Hello my friends, I'm very happy you clicked the thumbnail and joined me on this video. Uh, recently Viltrox uh, reached out to me and asked if I would like to review another one of the uh, lights. They sent me a link to see what it was and I was sh answer sure I'm happy to, to receive that free stuff but not at the expense of being honest. So in this video I'm gonna do my honest review of the Viltrox light that I received. Uh, this one is the VLS192B-T professional LED light. Um, it took me a while to, to make this video because I was out on vacation in uh, Croatia. Uh, more of that in a uh, coming video. I'm planning to do a video about my vacation there. And so let's do the unboxing and see what this light is all about. I got my GoPro ready. Yeah, let's go. So again, this is the Viltrox uh, LED light, professional LED light that they've sent. I believe I have this one, not this one in the box I'm not sure I actually just took this package out of the Amazon box and haven't seen what's inside yet and it's been sitting waiting for me to open it all right so it's oh the the it comes inside a bag there's a b very nice carrying bag inside let's pull it out it was like a certificate viltro certificate here yeah. uh, this is a very nice carrying bag with a rich viltrox logo here in uh, some kind of a plastic let's open it and see what's inside all right so we got some kind of manual in here in chinese and english oh it's got a remote there's a Remote control says here, maybe it's in the box. And there is warranty card. Okay. This is like a Neopam uh, protection. And this is the panel itself. Okay. Don't need this. Two batteries in the box and there is a DC in here some control knobs and a screen and on this side this is like a diffuser with magnets that attach uh, bond doors yeah I was I was actually right correct about the model these barn doors and I think that I can attach the diffusion here like that yeah nice what's next there's a power and a power brick a remote controller Maybe need batteries. Yeah, there's a silica gel inside. No batteries. Inside, there's another thing. Oh, there's a, a light stand adapter. Very nice. And I don't think there are batteries for the remote. 
No. Doesn't look, there's a lot of cutouts here. Uh, I don't see, no, there's nothing else in here. So there is a nice uh, neoprene cage to put the light inside and, and protect it from when you, when you travel or when you need to store it. Uh, let's put some batteries and see if the batteries for the lights are charged and see how it works. All right, so I got some uh, AAA batteries inside for the remote. Uh, I've got the uh, illumination light on the background for the remote. So this remote can control, I think it's an RF remote, it's not uh, infrared. So I think there are like, I think there are like multiple groups that you can set uh, the lights to control. So you don't have, you, should, you can use one, uh, one controller for multiple lights. Let's see on the back of the light itself. When you turn it on, So, you have the channel, this one is 2A and this one is 1A, set, there you go, 2A, set, as you can see, it's saying receiving and I can control the light, clicking on off, closes and open the light. Oh, that's very nice. So what else in here? I think there are some more features. There's a 150% button. If you close, click it, it will go to 150% power and count down until it's, it's not, uh, it's not gonna remain on 150% for long. Yeah, and the group and channel. So group control, when I click this one, I can change the group and click the channel and click set. I suppose in the remote, if I click set, I have to change the channel. This one changed the color up and down. This one changed the power and the set. Okay, let's wrap it all up and go back to the uh, studio. All right, so I figured out how to change the channel. Just hold press the set button on the remote. It will allow you to uh, set the channel. So this is with the light. I only have this light. There's light in the room, of course. And there's a window over there with some light from the sun from the outside but if i will close the light here as you can see the effect that it makes and i'm on 400 iso on a camera so as you can see the effect that it makes noticeable uh, i'm using the diffuser right now so the light uh, that hits my face is a little more softer I can adjust from the remote the color temperature if I want to make it a little bit more warm. It feels like when I make it warmer, the light has a little bit more power. It seemed a little more bright. And then when I change it back to a more cold temperature for towards the 5600 Kelvin, it feels like the power is a little uh, um, lower. There is also an option here to dim the light a bit if you want. From the document I can read for you and of course you can do it yourself but it's uh, 192 LED uh, pieces of uh, LEDs inside that are dull purpose. They have uh, the white and the yellow uh, color temperature and you can like I show you uh, switch between them 
and it has a remote that can control a number of channels I think there are 19 yeah 19 uh, channels and uh, six groups which is with one remote is is a lot uh, I, I don't think I'll I have that many lights in my little studio. Yeah. The light remote is FSK 2.4 GHz wireless remote controller system. It has dual power supplies. Uh, as you saw in the opening, there are um, two batteries on the back. Thank you for watching this video and if you want to see more of my videos, you can check my playlist or you can subscribe uh, to get notified when I'm uploading a new video. Don't forget to hit that bell icon. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Uh, it really helps me a lot and uh, promoting my video with the YouTube algorithm to the rest of the world. If you want to ask me something or have any kind of comments on this video or others, you can contact me by writing some comments below. So until next time, bye.